What we saw on Saturday, I think, was really disappointing, where we had people resorting to physical violence in a manner to suppress free speech. And I don't think that that's acceptable. And we have to push back against that. You know, it doesn't matter whether or not people agree or disagree with Posey Parker. She had a right to her view uh, and people had a right to be I, able to hear it. But didn't, I, but didn't people have a right to also oppose those views there as well, Brooke? Of course, people always have the right for a peaceful protest. But what we saw were people uh, throwing items at her, throwing uh, liquids at a speaker who was wanting the ability to freely speak. I do not want our society to become a divided society where we resort to physical aggression to suppress people's individual opinions. That is not a society I want New Zealand to be. We should be a peaceful society that allows people to hold a range of different views where we can openly debate and use reason and logic to come to analysis of ideas rather than physical acts of aggression and intimidation. I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just not gonna let that cringy revisionist history stand. If you look to the experience of thousands of Aucklanders who turned up to showcase that trans rights are human rights, then you will see thousands of people who had an experience of a peaceful protest. cringy revisionist. A peaceful protest. Cringy revisionist, 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 a peaceful protest. A peaceful protest. A peaceful protest. A peaceful protest. Cringy revisionist. Cringy revisionist. Cringy revisionist. Cringy revisionist. A peaceful protest.